Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Maria Alejandra and for today's video I have this set of comic nails. This is a very popular trend that is all over social media so I wanted to give it a try and since we are in fall and winter season I chose to do this trend in nude colors. So the colors that I'm using are like nudes, pinks and browns. So I'm doing this set for like a present nail set, but if you want, you can do this design on top of your gel, acrylic or your poly gel. So I started out applying some acetone on the tips. This is how I prep the tips. I don't buff the tips. I just uh, take um, some acetone and apply it on the tips. Then I go and apply some acid free primer and then some base coat now we are using this brand of gel polish is Venalisa this is a very very good brand and their polishes are cheap so if you are starting out with nails and you don't know um, which brand you are going to get and you and your budget is limited I can't not recommend this brand enough when i started out with nails i bought uh, this uh, polishes from this brand i got a 60 gel polishes bundle and i mean after five years i'm still using them for my tutorials and yeah i think that they have changed their presentation now they have black bottles with uh, gold uh, but uh, the product is the same the colors that I'm using you can see the the numbers I'm going to put them in the description box down below and we are going to apply two coats of the colors and we are going to cure in between and then we'll continue with the design now i'm taking a little amount of product of the previous color we chose and i put them down here in my palette and we are going to mix the colors with some black gel polish we want to get a darker uh, shade if you have like the colors already then you can use that you don't need to mix but since it's easier like just to take some of the previous color and mix them with black polish that's what i'm going to do so you can um, see by yourself if you want to go darker then you can apply some more black polish and yeah you can see and it's up to you and your preference uh, now for the line work i'm using my 15 millimeters liner brush and i do recommend that you get a striper or a long brush for the lines otherwise you're going to struggle and if you wiggle with your hands everything is going to be seen on the nail so for line works i do recommend to get a long brush so I take the product and then I do the design in one movement and then I fill in and for the last part I'm just painting this line and we are going to do the same on all the nails and then we'll continue with the black gel paint don't forget to cure when you are done with this step
For our next step, I'm taking some gel paint and it's very important that you use gel paint and not gel polish because gel polish can move a little and we need to be very, very precise with the lines that we are going to make. We're going to create kind of like a frame in black. So using the same brush, just go along the nail and paint uh, like a frame uh, around the nail. If you are not so sure about doing this, just start with a little amount of product and then you can go and fill in later. But you don't need much. And yeah, if you are using a long brush, you can do this in one movement and it will work just fine. Now that I'm done with the lines, I'm going to put some other lines here on the top. We have a line with black just from the tip down to the middle. And we are doing this on all the nails. And then we put it in the lamp to cure. The last step is taking some gel paint, some white gel paint, and I'm painting this line starting from the cuticle down to the tip. I create kind of a curving line and a dot. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Then we put the, the nails into the lamp and cure for 60 seconds. At this point, you can decide if you want to have your nails shiny or with matte top coat. I'm going to apply some shiny top coat because I want them to be shiny. So yeah, this is the final result. What do you think about this design? I love them so much. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and to give me a thumbs up and I see you on the next video. Bye-bye.